Mariel S. Acosta. Grade 12 STEM from Dehaga National High School, Bungabong South District. Tour guiding is my chosen skill. Isak, Bungabong, Sukol, and Orkonoma that waters most of the farmlands. But before we begin the tour, please be reminded with all the safety protocols, guidelines, and precautions. Just remember the three C's. Clean, always wash and sanitize your hands. Cover, wear your face mask, face shield, or any cloth covering to cover your mouth. And lastly, connect. Always bring your phone with you and stay informed with the most up-to-date info. Time check? It's 8.26 in the morning. For weather update, it's 28 degrees Celsius with 20% chance of rain. Speaking of history, if you like Filipino architectures, we have here the Central House of Inagan and Kamali family. Every year, during the month of March on day 15, the famous Festival Suliog is being celebrated. The name Suliog is a combination of the Mangyong term Suli, meaning banana, and the Tagalog word Niyog for coconut. Presented in a street dance, Suliog Festival is the culmination of Thanksgiving rites in honor of the town patron St. Joseph where the performers portray the harvesting of bananas and coconuts, extracting coconuts from shell and dried for copra, the sorting of bananas for sale, and offering of these products to the patron saint. If you're into water activities, I recommend you our very own Mapang River, which became the center of attraction last summer. The local community of the San Barangay established Kubos to serve as a temporary shelter while your family is busy wading into the cold and refreshing crystal blue water that can only be found in Mapan. They also offer a life buoy rental where you can use it as a mover to float and go with the water until the end of the vicinity of their resort. Sad to say, it is now on occasions due to the destruction brought by the typhoon. But the community assured the tourists that they will reopen as soon as they finish recreating the beautiful vacation spot. However, if you really want water activities, you can find this up bridge around the area. You can dodge in the water and explore different rock formations that is very interesting to capture. All that in mind, let me welcome you to our first stop. This river behind me is one of the four largest rivers that surrounds the town. It is lined with mangrove forests of different species and teeming with birds and other fauna. They can now enjoy kayaking and spend the rest of the day in their floating kubo while watching the calm and captivating view of the sea. Fun fact! Did you know that Bungabong is not the original name of our town? Bungabong was first recognized during the 16th century as Binagao. It is a Mangyan word which means a big and dangerous river. And that turbulent river is now called Bungabong River. You see, Bungabong is full of fun activities. Now, let me bring you to the Eco Agricultural Farm in Bungabong, the Gubutero Organic Farm. It is the only accredited organic farm in Oriental Mindoro. It produces vermiculture and vermicomposting in a 4,425 hectares land, an organic rice and vegetable, and a 9 hectares agricultural land. In addition to this, the farm also raises soft-shelled turtles, 
hogs, rabbits, and poultries. The Gubotero Organic Farm is now a partner of ATI RTC Region 4 in its advocacy to promote organic farming. Welcome to Adelao Echo Village! This Echo Park is an ecosystem and community-based tourism program initiated by Attorney Reynaldo Mali is now on hit. And since it is a protected area, soon it will serve as a haven for the migratory birds, fireflies, mud crabs, and fishes. This echo village is the site of model mud houses. They have one single unit, one family sized houses, and one dormitory. And by chance, this can provide additional income to local fish and fox in the form of room rentals or homestays. Fisher Fox also serves as tour guide during mean season. They also have different cottages that fit for any kind of occasion. Beautiful garden landscapes decorated with boulders, Bermuda grass, and concrete blocks patwalk, perfect for garden weddings and prenuptial pictorials. The tourism of Bungabong is now open despite the pandemic while ensuring the safety and security of every tourist. Just always bear in mind the three C's, clean, cover, and connect. Come and visit the Central of Organic Farming of Oriental Mindoro, Bungabong!